Hey everybody, I'm Bill and I'm on the water. I'm your source for everything that's sailing, boating, and everything to do with that waterfront lifestyle. Today we're going to check out a brand new Everglades 34 dual console. It is a hot up and comer. All you center console guys, you need to check out this boat. Hey everybody, I'm Bill and I'm on the water. I'm here with Sean. He's a regional manager here for Everglades and we're on a beautiful 34 foot Everglades. Okay, yeah, welcome aboard the, the 340DC or the Everglades 340DC. This is our first venture into the dual console market over 30 feet. We designed a boat that we feel is the best fit for the fishermen and the family that likes to cruise, go to the, go to the sandbar, go, go tubing, you name it, uh, an all around boat. Uh, we've done a lot of innovation on this boat, just like we always do with every boat that we build. And starting number one with safety and durability and fit and finish, as, as all Everglades have. And we've continued that into the dual console and adding a little bit more family friendly features. This thing rides like a dream. I happened to be out on this boat a couple of months ago in a nor'easter. Man, it handled like a champ. Uh, air conditioning and heating inside this, it's an open boat. The heat works like oh, incredible. Well, we, what we wanted to do was build a boat that ran as well as our offshore boats. This this is a very similar hull to our hull that'll run to the canyons and do fishing. So what we have underneath is a very solid platform, but on top we put all the amenities. Absolutely. Got diesel generator with air conditioning. We've got uh, the uh, sea keeper capabilities. Lots of versatile seating, dive door standard. Uh, the things that you're you're looking for when you want to go out with the family and have a good time. But you're never going to have to worry about the ride. So Sean, let's start at the stern of this boat. The 425s are on the back, people. Hot, everybody yeah. wants them. Yeah, the 425 is uh, uh, Yamaha's newest engine, and we've done a, a considerable amount of testing with those engines over the last six months, and they have proven themselves to us. Uh, we love them. They're, they, this boat was built for them. She, they, it runs great. Uh, you know, top end in the mid 50s, but cruising in the 35 to 45 mile an hour range is real nice with the, with the four and a quarters. Absolutely. Starting coming through the transom, right? Yeah, uh, what we did on the, on the DC is we put a uh, transom door as well as a side door. So you have two ways of boarding the boat. If you're backing in or if you're a side tie, it makes it nice. Uh, if you do do some fishing, the side door makes a, a great way to bring your fish in or your catch in. And then if you're diving or, you, or, or, or swimming off the boat, uh, you have uh, real easy access to get in. We have a versatile cockpit. We have two different setups. We have flip down seats. Uh, we have two flip down seats in the back or we can do a U-shaped, more lounge type seating with a, with a large uh, teak table. Uh, uh, a release teak table is very nice, which drops down to a sun lounge. Depending on what your, your needs are, you may want to fish more. Uh, the cockpit is huge when you put the fishing package in it. It definitely makes um, uh, it gives you plenty of room to go out and fish with, with your friends. So, so if I'm out there for the afternoon and I'm starting to get hungry and I have a couple fish, what can I do to secure my hunger? Oh, well, the boat comes uh, with, a, with a barbecue as well. So we have we, we have we have a live well. We have a huge cooler in the back. Actually, two coolers that we can you can store anything that you catch. But we also do have a refrigerator and a uh, a stove in order to cook up if you like to, or or an outdoor barbecue. You like say, to freshest fish. Yeah. We're gonna cook that yeah. stuff up. Yeah, right? just eat it raw, right? Yeah. We're getting the tuna. So, okay. Uh, welcome to the helm area of the 340 DC. What we've done here is we've incorporated a double seat on both sides, so you have port and starboard seating for two people. The helm area we wanted it to have the latest and greatest in electronics and have big screens. So we, we, we set it up so that it can handle two 16-inch screens. Uh, we use the Garmin uh, set up here, and you can get radar, GPS, fish finder, autopilot, all that stuff incorporated into it. When you do the four and a quarters, Yamaha's, it comes also standard with the with the Hellmaster, which makes the boat very maneuverable. It has set points so that if you at a drawbridge or you're waiting for a dock space to open up, you can hit that and the boat will stay right on station until you're ready to move. Uh, we also do a patented windshield system on here, which is very unique uh, to the industry. We're the only people that uh, or company that does that. Uh, our windshield opens and closes electrically instead of having the big barn door that you see on the majority of dual consoles, which are finger busters. They're very heavy. The kids can't move them. By the with the push of a button, you can open and close our windshield. Sean, I'm out in the sun all day, starting to get a little hot, need a little relief. What can I do? We have a couple of different options for shade on the boat. Uh, number one, which we which we really like, is we've started using a product called uh, Makefast, and it's a it's a retractable top. It does it electrically. By the push of a button, it will it'll retract out 
covering the entire cockpit, aft cockpit, and with another flip of the button, it'll fold itself up very neatly, very smoothly. Uh, it's all it's an internal cable system. It, it, it it's fantastic. And then up forward, we have the option for a a shade that comes off the hard top and goes forward and covers the entire forward seating area. So Sean, here we are moving forward to the bow. It's beautiful. Tell us all about it. Yeah, what we wanted to do in the bow was make it a safe area because safety is first concern for us. So we, we kept the gunnel height high in there, but we put a very thick cushion so you still have the good visibility, but it's comfortable and it's safe. So if your children are up there or yourself and, and it gets a little bumpy, you don't have to worry about getting tossed because you are pretty deep into the boat as well. We offer a nice seat up there, two storage bins and a cooler, uh, very comfortable uh, armrests that flop down and cup holders. And USB plugs for your, for your phone, you want to be able to charge your phone up there as well. Okay, on the starboard side of the boat we have a cabin. It's a single bunk or a bench that can convert over to a double bunk. It, it's climate controlled and there's a TV down there. So if you want to spend the night on the boat or the kids want to get out of the weather and just go down there and have a little their little fort to go into, uh, it's it's really sharp like that. The uh, on the other side of the boat we have a, a full head that has a that has a, a sink, shower. Um, it's all teak floorboards. It's, it's very nice, nicely appointed um, with the uh, with the fixtures and everything else. So something we forgot to mention. It's the party. Thump 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 to my stereo. Yeah, what we it's got? all about the music, right? Yeah. Well, we have the fusion heads head units on on all of our boats. Uh, we only use premium systems, so we use amps, we use JL audio in our speakers, we put them in the hard top, in the cockpit, up in the bow. You can separate them too, they're also down in the cabin. And uh, we you know, we want to have good sound on the boat. And uh, just like everything on the Everglades, we use the premium systems that we can find. Every single boat that we build, from our 23 footer all the way up to our 43 builder, is built with a process called Ramcap. It'll, it, it makes the boat unsinkable. But the, the difference between us and the other, other boat manufacturers is that our boat is one piece construction. We don't have stringers and a deck and a hull all working against each other and, 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 and spi spinning or rotating or, or flexing. We have one solid piece construction with six pound density foam. You could, build, you could build a home out of that. And what that does is allow for a much stronger, more rigid, solid ride. And you'll see it when you get out on the water. Nothing rattles, nothing shakes. And we have that's why we have the best warranty in the industry. We have a lifetime hull warranty that's not prorated, that's transferable, and um, up to 10 years to the second owner. But it definitely is the strongest, uh, most durable uh, hull on the, on the market. Well, that's pretty awesome. Well, I really appreciate the time today. It's an absolutely beautiful boat that, like I said, it handles like a dream. Uh, if you're in the center console market and you're looking for something a little different to spend overnight, check out the DC because it's really wide, high performing boat, and it's the Everglades, so the details on it are just absolutely incredible. Thank I you. I appreciate your time, Sean. Thank you. I'm right. going to put the link for Everglades below. I'll put the link for Annapolis Boat Sales too because Walter's here. You know, he's crazy. So I really appreciate your time. Thank you. So for Sean, I'm Bill, and we're on the water. Hey, if you like what you saw today, please like and subscribe to my channel. Until next time, everybody.